may, like maybe I want more swamps, but I, I do have those free spell bombs, so I definitely want the green. I also have a black mirror, so let's go with that. I'll see you round one. So uh, here's round one. My opponent mulganed. He's on the play. I'll keep this on the draw, even though I don't quite yet have double black for the grasp. I have the spell bomb to help, and I have some. I don't have anything early, but he did mulgan. Looks like he's infect, which isn't the greatest of news. If, if, if he has a good, oh, that's that's that that that, blah, blah, that definitely helps. But if he's a good aggressive uh, infect deck, it's not the greatest of matchups, especially since my artifact removal is pr going to be pretty weak, likely to be pretty weak, unless I have liquid metal coating. Although there's two infect guys. Uh, that are artifacts. The Tell had Fallen actually looks pretty good right around now. <coughs> uh, not the most exciting draw, but if I can stabilize and get to 8 mana, well, I guess I'm a favorite to win. <laughs> But I think that's the case with this deck in general, but this is one of the reasons that that is the case. I don't know if I want to... Well, I'm definitely not blocking the Vector Asp here. He can't... I'll take a damage against um, an Infect deck. I'll go to 18 very happily, and I'm not going to just chump with my Leaden Mirror. Well, there's another swamp, which is good news. Um, I could slice and twain, but I think I'd rather just play uh, the fallen. It, it actually looks like I'm an infect deck right now. That's not really the case. Okay, so I think uh, what I want to do here is get another. Get uh, ooh, maybe I get my mountain here, because I do have the double black for the grasp. Oh, I have another spell on. Okay, so I'm gonna get, I'm gonna go ahead and draw a card and get a mountain, and I'm probably gonna grasp of darkness, the cis bear. I think I just want to do that during my turn. I could also attack with the fallen. I don't. I don't know that I really can expect to poison him to death, though. And I think I'd. I think I'd rather just not take poison scanners. That being said, um, I do have the clone shell to come uh, help block them next turn. But but like if he has another infect guy. I probably just want to trade my Fallen for it. Yeah, I think I'm just going to avoid... I'm, avo I'm going to avoid taking a Poison Counter here. I think I just want to sort of get to the late game. I'm close... I'm getting closer to Tower of Calamity's dam uh, mana. Uh, I could slice that to Twain, but it, it, it's not all that exciting against me right now. He can't target my Fallen, so I think I have time to do that later. He, He's likely to not really want to uh, use it on my Clone Shell, so I think I'm just going to get my Clone Shell out there. Let's see what I draw. If, if I draw. if I draw something that I want to get into play, then I'm going to attack with my Fallen here. Well, well Mulder Beast is a good one. Not the best, but but pretty good. <clears throat> All right. I I don't think there's any harm in attacking here. I don't I don't know if he wants to. I'll we'll see if he wants to attack into my clone shell. He may not want to. I'm gonna get the horizon spell bomb out there too. I, c 
could use another swamp, seeing as my uh, lead mirror might die. Okay, so he wants to get a uh, poison counter on me. I, I, I'm actually going to block the vector. Uh, sure, I'll block the vector asp here. I might get a counter off his Trigon of Corruption. I, I, I can't imagine he's in a hurry to get a creature into play on his turn, though. And, uh, this makes it sort of interesting for him to want to, whether he wants to tap his black mana. Seeing as there's only one of them in play, and he may have a black card in hand. <coughs> uh, an attack here by him makes me think he may have something like the pump spell. So it's... Because if, if he really wants to force through the poison damage, it it, it makes it possible he has uh, something to finish like, to get a lot of poison counters on me in a hurry, like the like the uh, the green pump stall. Acid web spider. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna play the acid web spider here. Get another blocker. I I, I think I'm gonna continue to attack with the fallen. as uh, he's already going to be at 6 poison damage. He doesn't have mana to play something like carry on uh, whatever it's called, the, the instant spell that puts two infect tokens in play. And he can't kill both my mirror and my clone shell. Ah, uh, he could. But then I get another, yet another guy in play. But uh, like I don't, I don't think I have trouble blocking his Iron Claw Mirror next turn. Either Trump blocking, or even blocking with my Acid Web Spider. I could have just sliced it in twain, but it's not all that threatening at the moment. That being said, I, I don't know how much of a... Oh, he's just going to concede. I don't know how... Uh, I'm so, sort of surprised he's conceding there. I guess his hand is pretty bad, but... Yeah. Alright. So, uh... It is in fact... Uh... I mean, Blight Mamba, on the one hand, can deal with opposing Blight Mambas or that artifact guy that I just saw, but it's also not going to be regenerating too much. Uh, Trigon inf infestation is also sort of interesting, as is even Vector Asp. Um, I do think I want to reduce my... Uh, my insult infections are probably going to be pretty good here. Uh, I, think, I think I'm going to take out Tower of Calamities. I think that I'm a favorite if I can survive the early rush either way. Uh, I, 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 I'm a little reluctant to bring in Azuri Archers if I don't see multiple uh, of the Flying Infect guy. So out of, I mean, out of these guys, I think I like the Blight Mamba the best. It does cost mana more, but I don't I don't have to keep a swamp open. 
to make it in fact, like I do with the vector asp. Uh, tells you defiances actually seem like they're they're okay here, um, and I think I want to keep in liquid metal coating just because like my removal is mostly uh, artifact based. So I could like cut Acid Web Spider, but in fact deck probably has some equipment. I can't. It's hard to judge what his deck actually looks like. Uh, I do like Clone Shell. Maybe I can cut a Molder Beast for another one of these guys. And Trigon of Infestation actually seems like it might be okay to help me stabilize. I'm going to go with this. Before I do, like, if we go to game three and I see a much more aggressive and, and I get a better idea of what his, his infect creature base looks like, then I can start thinking about the uh, the green trigon. For now, I think I'll just stick with this. Uh, this is... Yeah, I don't think I can keep this. He's Mulligan, too. Okay. Oh, that's a little better. Uh, hopefully that scrap melter actually deals with something, but he will ask him myself plenty of artifacts. No, that's that's gonna help to some extent. Oh, no two drop, that's always a good sign when up against an infect deck. And even though I did play a few non-infect creatures, he still might think that I'm an infect deck. Um, okay, so I think here maybe I just put another mirror in play so that I can jump block one of them. Um, I think I'm going to want to draw a card off the Defiance. I don't really want to hold it. I kind of just want to dig into some more action here. So I'm not going to play with the Spell Bomb. Um, my plan right now is to block the rats with the Leaden Mirror, if he attacks. Hmm. That might force me to bring out my, uh, Scrap Melter, unfortunately. Well, hopefully I can dig into something else. Clone Shell is not that. Um, hmm. So, do I just get out the scrap melt, or maybe I just dig? I think actually what I'll do here is I'll pl I'm going to take some poison from the fallen, which is unfortunate. But I think I, I play my clone shell, and then I at least I can scrap melt through my own clone shell next turn. And, or or he might attack with the uh, the rats into it. And maybe I get to see something really good off of it. Or it could be nothing, which is definitely unfortunate. Oh, well, at least I put all those lands at the bottom. Hopefully this holds back his rats. I, I, I think I'm forced to block his rats either way. No, okay. It, it held back his rats. But, uh, I think I got... Well, hopefully, maybe he plays an artifact here. Nope. 